Apprenons le cha-cha-cha. Le cha-cha-cha. Since the historic voyage of Columbus, the science of map making has played a leading role in the birth and development of America. It's easy to forget with smartphones and GPS that once upon a time, people used to use paper maps when they were getting around. Like this, this is an old OS map of Northern Ireland. Now, if you were using a map like this, the way you would measure two, the distance between two points is you would get a ruler, but that doesn't really help you because it's a straight line. So you'd have to do all kinds of complicated, like here to here to here to here to here. It's just exceedingly complicated, right? You wanna know the distance between Cookstown and Dungannon. That's all you wanna know. You don't wanna fuss about it. You don't wanna have all this hassle. You just wanna know how many miles is it from here to here because you're driving in your car and you want to make sure you got enough petrol. The boys better step on it or they'll never make their deadline. That's where the Velos clicker comes in. It essentially measures the distance between two places on a map and works with any scale and audibly gives you a notification of when you've reached a mile. So you can count off the miles as you're measuring and go, do 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 oh, it's so many miles from here to here. For old tech, this is surprisingly advanced. Presto! And right at their fingertips, modern motorists can have an information bureau on any road they may wish to take. I'm going to show you exactly what's in it. There's not a lot. So if we open this bad boy up, right, what we got is we have the clicker, we got the instructions, and we got the little sleeve. That is it. That's all that's in this. That's all the tech that there is to be had. Three little things, two of which are paper. But how many of us ever stop to think what a tremendous task it is to keep constant check on the millions of miles of roads in the United States. So aside from looking beautiful, this is just the packaging, right? It's got a little bit of information. It's made by Velos. They make a bunch of stuff in England out of Bakelite and that kind of thing. Hikers, bikers, motorists, and soldiers, the four demographics that cover everyone. Let's get into the meat of the matter, right? I'm gonna put this aside for a second and show you just the instructions. Aside from having really, really beautiful uh, illustrations on it, which is uh, typical for stuff of this kind of vintage. It has some really, really straightforward instructions. When in general use. Remember, small disc is exactly one inch in circumference, and four clicks means one revolution of the wheel, i.e. one inch is being covered. Therefore, when any measurement is required on paper or elsewhere, a complete turn of the disc, which is four clicks, means one inch. Two turns, eight clicks, two inches, so on. Thus, in carrying a clicker, you have a, a rule always at hand. So essentially what it's saying, in its kind of uh, oldie worldy speak. Map making in the olden days was like painting a masterpiece. You basically use the number of clicks with the scale of your map to work out how far it is. So this map that we're using is a quarter inch map, which means it's one quarter inch to a mile, which means that on this little clicker, every single click that we hear will be one mile. So let's open it up and I'll show you how it works. It's really, really simple, but also pretty ingenious. So you can see that it's got just a little bit of uh, a little bit of writing on it. For any scale maps example, one inch, four clicks to the mile. So the instructions couldn't be clearer. There's an instruction booklet, there's instructions on the packaging, and then there's instructions on the thing itself. So this is the clicker, the 1460 British made Velos map mile recorder. You'll see there's just a little metal cap and that covers all of the workings of this entire device. This little bit here, this little wheel, this is your clicker. This is what you measure with. This is how you are going to measure the distances between these certain towns. If I press down light, you might not be able to hear it on my finger, but if I press down, you can hear a little click. And that's because of the offset of this little wheel. So every click on this map is one mile. So if we want to measure the distance between Dungannon and Cookstown, following this road through Stewartstown, because we don't want to go as the crow flies, because that's not really an accurate representation. What we're gonna do is we're gonna follow this road from Dungannon up through here, round here, and up into Cookstown. Cookstown where they make sausages. Yes, it's swell teamwork on the part of everyone. And we're gonna do it with this and get a measurement from that. And I'm gonna put on screen now the measurement that Google Maps, Google Earth, tells me the distances between Dungannon and Cookstown. I've used this before, it's pretty accurate. So let's see what it's like, real work conditions. I'm blind doing this. I have no idea if it's gonna be accurate or not. Let's give it a go and see what this comes up with versus what Google Maps says it is. So the first step is to just place the, the marker right on where you're starting from. So we've gotta follow this road. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 
So I'm, this makes 12 miles. So there's a little bit of rounding there. There's probably a little bit of a degree of error, but that's the distance that came up with versus the distance that Google Maps came up with. So I don't know if that's good or not, but in my experience, this little thing is, is pretty accurate for being a wheel on a stick. In other words, drive with care. Velos made a whole bunch of desktop stuff, uh, but this kind of thing is just incredible. This is something I didn't even know existed. It's just perfect. It's such a cool little package. This is it. I mean, someone, someone designed this. That is it. That is the whole thing. It's got the instructions here. It's got the instructions here, here, here. It's got the instructions on it itself. I mean, they want you to know how to use this. They want this to be in your your glove box, they want this to be in your pocket. It's incredible that something like this was produced. And I, I really miss products like this. I really wish people made more stuff like this. And if I ever make stuff, it's gonna be kind of this kind of, in this vein. So there you go. Measures as it clicks. For hikers, bikers, motorists, and soldiers. Invaluable to all. When you come up to bad news like that, there's only two things left to do. Get a tractor or turn back.